Friday night, thousands of people packed the Darien Lake Amphitheater for headliners g Easy, Lil Uzi Vert, and Ty Dolla Sign. Among the thousands of hip-hop fans, 30-year-old Twin No, who was at the concert with her boyfriend and a couple of friends. Here's her before the concert. And here's her after. Scrapes and gashes on her face, bruises, and a knocked out tooth. Now my tooth is broken, so as I'm trying to spit my tooth out so I don't swallow it, I felt like jabs and hand, they were just coming at my face. No says she was jumped by four girls toward the end of the show when she was coming out of the restroom. She says the girls whom she didn't know pulled her hair and poured beer in her eyes. And when she tried getting away, she says that's when they started punching her. And like behind here, here, like my hair, my head is still tender. And then the same guy, he jumped in again and he was like, what are you guys doing? Like she didn't do anything to you. Like how can you guys do that? And he like broke us free and he was like, just run, run, like don't even walk, just run. No says she ran to security. And as I'm standing there talking, the security lady said two girls just came, like pushed me to the ground, pull my hair. They dragged me down the concrete and just kept dragging me and security did absolutely nothing. She says the girls got away and security refused to take any type of statement, calling the brawl mutual. No says she's now left feeling terrified and needs oral surgery, a tooth implant that will cost thousands of dollars. The tooth is gone. It's, they took away something from me that belongs to me. And I can never get it back, you know. And the Genesee County Sheriff's Office is currently investigating this incident. I also reached out to Darien Lake and Live Nation. Both tell me they too are investigating. No says she really just wants someone to be held accountable for what she says was a horrific assault. We're live in the newsroom tonight. Hannah Bueller, 7 Eyewitness News.